Hey Craig, Stephen here from CMP Automotive, and this right here is a 2021 Toyota Tundra Super Crew TRD Sport Premium. Quite the mouthful. <laughs> so starting up front, you get full LED headlamps, you get fog lamps down the bottom, and exclusive to the TRD Sport Premium package, you get the hood scoop up there. Uh, paint, well, it is a dark gray metallic with a very nice metallic flake that I'm not sure if the camera is picking up on. Um, in addition to that, I'm proud to say, or happy to say that it does have 3M on the front end, up to right here. So fender, hood, grill, and front bumper. Um, I also see front parking sensors down the front bumper as well. Now unique to the TRD Sport Premium, um, you get these 20 inch wheels um, and you also get uh, off-road shocks. I believe they're built by Bilstein. I could be mistaken. Um, again, Super Crew, so that's their crew cab configuration with a short box. I'll get into interior in a moment, but uh, moving along to the rear, you of course get a backup camera right there. In addition to backup sensors down the back bumper, you get a class four hitch receiver, your four pin and seven pin harnesses right there. Of course, your spare tire peeking out down below. Uh, when it comes to the, when it comes to the, uh, uh, the bed, <laughs> it is, uh, does have liner. It does appear to be spray and box liner. Um, most likely factory given the quality and how it looks. Also, has a dampened tailgate, so it doesn't just flop down as well. Uh, being a Toyota owner yourself, I'm sure you're aware, this has the rear sliding window that drops down just like that. It's pretty cool. Getting into the back seats. Oh, probably should mention, you have power deployable side steps. Coming automatically, of course. Back here. Seating for three across, full leather seating, armrest with cup holders there. You get a DC plug here and air conditioning vents down at the bottom. Also included are OEM Toyota all-weather mats. The seats, of course, fold up like that. And same with the other side, you could tuck some belongings underneath here. And to release that, you simply pull that back. Mirrors are heated with blind spot monitoring. Pa uh, driver's seat is power operated, leather and heated with power lumbar supports. Of course, power windows, power door locks, hopping behind into the driver's seat, leather wrapped steering wheel. Get your uh, automatic shifter right there with Tiptronic. Cup holder ahead cup holders here so you got three across your heated seats your parking sensors which you can turn off or on and you have usb ins right there times three dual zone climate control um, as far as infotainment system goes um, it is a touch screen it does appear to have projection so foam projection and I believe you have to use, it's, it's gonna be wired connection. So Apple CarPlay and Android Auto would uh, most likely be through the USB down there. Uh, current mileage. Oh. I don't know why this is so dim. Uh, 114.061, right there. Above my head, I have a sunroof right here. Auto dimming rear view mirror so you don't get blinded by someone behind you with, uh, with high beams. And in here, you get a ton of storage, removable tray, and another DC plug right there. To the side here, you get uh, automatic uh, high beams. This is gonna be your switch for the rear sliding window, which I always thought was one of the coolest things about Toyota, Toyota SUVs and uh, pickup trucks. Power mirrors, of course, all that. Uh, you have uh, steering wheel controls for your, your radio, your Bluetooth, your cruise control, all that. It also has uh, lane departure warning, which is pretty neat. Uh, going under the hood, 
This of course has the 5.7 liter iForce V8. I'm sure you're well versed in Toyota products. If not, they're uh, legendary reliability. This vehicle, of course, will be uh, fully certified. Just needs a little bit of cleanup, which we can certainly do. Uh, oh, one thing I wanted to uh, touch on, undercoating. I looked underneath. I cannot say yes or no if it hasn't. I, I don't see anything. Maybe it was done when the vehicle was new, but I, I can't really tell. Uh, what I did see, it does at least have um, butt flaps front and rear. Anyway, thanks all for watching, Craig. Um, I'll follow up this video with a quick uh, phone call after I send it. Uh, we'll chat soon.